Joining me here on Manning Field after his team's 37-13 win over Archbishop Williams of St. Mary's head coach, Sean Driscoll. Sean, it probably wasn't as easy as the score you know, seems. They never are. The score is not, you know, it doesn't reflect how the game went. But I will tell you, you know, coming out, I praise my team for coming out, playing a team back-to-back -back Friday nights and uh, playing as well as we did at times. I think we've had, you know, uh, a tough little goal of it in the first half and second quarter. had trouble executing at times, which is frustrating, but uh, hats off to them. They, they played hard in their very physical football team, and we had to match that, and I think we did a good job of that. You managed to get ahead and, and stay ahead. You never really gave them an opportunity to really get back into the game. Yeah, I think uh, that, that stop at the second half before the half ended was big for us. Um, I made him punt and try to get the ball and do something with it afterwards, which didn't work out the way I was hoping to. But at the same time, coming out in the second half, I think, was a huge swing for us in the game because they got the ball and we had to keep them out of the end zone so we can keep our momentum when we did that. So very, very proud of my guys, especially defensively. We just got to do a little bit better job on fundamentals of tackling and uh, get getting to the ball a little quicker. Yeah, you don't, you don't see it very often on any level of football where you score safety and then you get the ensuing kick, and you take it back 65 yards to the house. You're right, yes. It was, we, were, we were fortunate to get a nice uh, block punt by Nick Sacco down here and made them punt, uh, kick from their 20. They decided to punt the ball to us, and we have some pretty you know, decent athletes back there. One bounce, picked it up, and, and found a little seam, and it was gone. It was a short field, so we were fortunate. But, uh, you know, like I said, it's a team, it's a team effort. It's a, it's a max effort, and I like the way we controlled the line of scrimmage up front for a majority of the game. I know it's still early, but do you have an idea of who you're going to play next week? It looks like I was told Linfield, and that was from someone who might know or might know, but it sounded like it was Linfield next week here at 6:30. Oh, that's well, you, you still yeah, it's nice, and you know, you you play for home field, and you get in the playoffs in this tournament, and everybody likes to be home, so that's good, and we we were guaranteed two home games, so we're, we're fortunate as long as we just keep playing solid and and keeping this train rolling. Great. Coach, congratulations. Always great to see Thank you. Thank you. Always